Hello YouTube, <coughs> excuse me, and welcome to my channel again. Um, I am going to retest these Heinz here batteries. Um, I was given information that I could have went down to 10 volts, which I wasn't sure. Let me change that back up to 10 amps. And um, I think also my lowest voltage I could go down to 10 volts, I was told, which I didn't know that either. Again, I'm all new to this. So I'm changing the settings, if you can see that there. So now we're at uh, 10 amps right here and we're at 10 volts. This battery was charged to 14.7 volts. Now, I only see what it shows when I hook it up. I just took it off the charger, so hopefully it should show a decent charge. But it was fully charged, it's sad, it can't go anymore. So as you can see, it's, it's showing 14.4, whatever it is. But I'll start the test now, uh, load on, and let's see what it does. We will let this run and I will bring you guys back and probably in about uh, well for you guys it'll be nothing but for me it's probably about I guess seven eight hours or so um, it's actually running pretty good let me see if I can if you guys can see those numbers or not now again I, I'm all new to this this was some information I was given so I'm gonna retest these and you know if it comes up better on the batteries that's great if not you know honestly these batteries i did get for my 36 volt mower i was doing and what happened was i bought one battery not realizing what i should have really done was buy a 36 volt battery that's what i should have done but i didn't do that instead i bought three 12 volt batteries because i wasn't sure how these batteries worked out these were 159 dollars i paid for them i bought one uh thought it worked out well so I bought another one that one came in as bad so after buying that one they sent me another one and what I found out was that the BMS on that one was bad so I actually have four of these batteries now three of them with the original BMS is what I'm testing at now and then I have a fourth one which I actually put my own BMS in because the BMS was bad the cells were fine but the BMS was bad so, so I have four of these three of them I'm using for my 36 volt mower um, obviously I have some other batteries too, but you know, I'm eventually going to use these for solar. I probably will get a 36 volt battery for my mower and use these as, uh, just 12 volt solar batteries, but the four of them would give me 400 amp hours. Now this, as I'm reading right now, this shows it was actually 1295 watt hours and 104 amp hours. So, but I did have a set, I did have it set at 11.1 .1 volts. Now, and that's when the test stops. So I'm not sure if this will be any better, but I will definitely bring you guys back when it's ready or closed and we'll do a comparison here and see what happens. So thank you so much for the, all the information. I do appreciate every, all the information everybody's been giving me. It's been helpful. I'm all new to this. So I do appreciate everything. I will bring you guys back soon. So I figured I would bring in the camera and give an update here. It's actually been running for about an hour and a half. Uh, I actually have it set to Chinese, actually, believe it or not, if you look at it. But I'll change that when it's all done. But to give you an example, an uh, hour and a half so far has been going. It's got about, um, you know, you can see the numbers there. Uh, it says 16, 8 amp hours. Um, 208 watt hours 130 watts so it's drawing 10 amps it's right now about 13 volts and you know i'm going to keep letting it go like i said it's in chinese but when it's all done i'll change it back to english and hopefully it won't reset anything but that'll be my numbers but i'm just going to continue the test so i'll bring it back when it's done so it looks like it's actually finished um so if i hit the end so this went down actually, uh, well, it went down actually eight volts. <laughs> I was actually supposed to stop at 10. Anyway, so it gave you 105.58 amp hours. And it looks like, that's not right, 351.10 watt hours. No, that doesn't look right, but anyway, that's what it's showing. So 
that's the updated test that was pretty much at you know fully charged it's actually down now to let me see yeah the battery's actually dead so it's actually showing five volts okay you know I could probably jump start the battery again because it's I'm sure it's the BMS that shut off but that gives you an answer uh, you know it's basically about the same I think over there I have it as uh, 104 I think it is let me see where it shows yeah right there it shows right there I got it as 104 so it's pretty much about the same right there as the other test I mean I guess it was able to go down a little bit lower in voltage but I uh, the results pretty much right around the same or so so anyway I guess that would conclude the test again and uh, I will reset it and you know I can try to do another one but anyway here are the updated results hope everybody enjoys that and thanks for watching like and subscribe take care